Hello everyone, welcome back to This Day in Weather. In this series, I'll talk about weather events that occurred in the United States on the same date as a video was posted in years past. Today, that date is February 3rd. On this day in 1844, Boston Harbor was so thick with ice that a channel had to be cut through the ice for the Britannia ship to leave with 30,000 letters for England. On this day in 1959, at 12.55 a.m. Central Time, a plane took off from Runway 17 at the Mason City, Iowa airport with Buddy Holly, Richie Valens, and J.P. the Big Bobber Richardson on board. At the time of departure, light snow was being reported at the airport with a ceiling of 3,000 feet with sky obscured, visibility of 6 miles, and winds from 20 to 30 miles per hour. Sadly, the plane crashed killing all three musicians and the pilot, and at around 9.35 a.m., Hubert Jerry Dwyer spotted the wreckage less than six miles northwest of the airport. On this day in 1988, Arctic air continued to invade the central U.S. The temperature in Midland, Texas plunged from a record high of 80 degrees to 37 degrees in just three hours. Morning lows in the higher elevations of Wyoming were as cold as minus 38 degrees. Heavy snow blanketed southwestern Colorado with 16 inches of poured in Steamboat Springs. That will do it for this edition of This Day in Weather, but be sure to stay tuned in because every time there's a new video, you will learn about weather events that occurred in the United States on the day the video was posted in years past. Please hit the thumbs up button to like this video, and please hit the subscribe button to be sure to never miss a new video.